Hello everyone and welcome back to the YouTube channel. So we have a very very important notification. It's fresh, it's the hottest, it's the latest. So this is the DBT GAT B 2022 and BET 2022 notification. Okay, so that is the graduate aptitude test for biotechnology and the biotechnology eligibility test 2022. The notification is out as well as the application portal is open to register. And this is also known as DBT JRF 2022. And as you can see, it also says get stipend on qualifying. So this is a must see, must read, must register for examinations. So let's quickly take a look at what these examinations are if you're new to this. And let's see how you can apply and avail it. A quick run through on what GAT B and BET is well the graduate aptitude test in biotechnology and the biotechnology eligibility test is a national level entrance examination for admission to the department of biotechnology supported postgraduate program in biotechnology and allied areas in participating institutions and for the award of DBT JRF for pursuing research in frontier areas of biotechnology okay so a uh, quick look at it so like i said the application portal is open so 11th of march and the last date for both is 31st march 2022 okay so there is an application fee so as you can see it's 1200 for each examination and if you're applying for both then it is 2400 this is for general category and for the reserved there are concessions okay now moving along to the eligibility criteria for both so if you're interested in this exam then biotechnica has some help for you we have our very own dbt grf quick bt reviser course so this is linked in the description box and you can also check it out on this page okay so it is linked throughout the page so you can check it out so let's take a look at the concerned examination. So starting off with graduate aptitude test for biotechnology. Okay, so this is an all India entrance examination to test the eligibility of Indian nationals for admissions to DBT supported postgraduate programs in biotechnology and allied areas at pass participating institutions and universities in India. So what are these supported postgraduate programs? These include MSc biotechnology and allied areas. MTech Biotechnology and Allied Areas, MSc Agricultural Biotechnology and MVSc Animal Biotechnology. Now this GAT B 2022 score is valid for admission to the above mentioned courses during the academic year of 2022-2023 only. Okay. Now qualified candidates of GAT B 2022 admitted to DBT supported postgraduate programs in biotechnology and allied areas at participating institutions universities in India will be paid a stipend okay so for the MSc biotech and allied areas rupees 5000 per month for MSc agricultural biotechnology rupees 7500 per month for MTech and MVSc programs rupees 12000 per month Okay, so this is an insanely beneficial opportunity that you have to undertake. Okay, and this is fresh off the boat and you're getting it right here at Biotechnica. So if you were part of the Telegram group, you've already seen it. So YouTube is also another way where we can communicate with you sooner. So do subscribe to this channel and turn on post notifications and follow Biotechnica everywhere because we'll always come up with these new exam notifications, admissions, etc. soon. Okay, now if you want more details, again, it's given in the information bulletin, which will be linked in this page. And this page where all of this is there is linked in the description box. Now coming to the biotechnology eligibility test 2022. Now this is the national qualifying examination for award of doctoral research fellowships under the DBT JRF program. Okay, so this is an all India computer based examination, which is held once a year. And these fellowships are tenable at any recognized university or institution in India where the selected fellow registers for their PhD program. Okay, so what are some of the details of the fellowship award? Award of the DBT JRF Category 1 fellowship entitles a shortlisted candidate for activation of fellowship subject to joining PhD program and subsequent registration of PhD from recognized university or institution across India within two years from the date of issuance of fellowship award letter okay 
Now, like I said, Biotechnica has its very own DBT JROF quick revisor course. So this is linked in the description. Do check it out. And also FSSAI exam notification is out. Again, course for that is also there at Biotechnica. All of those links are there in the description box. Now, what is the eligibility criteria for your GAT B? So only Indian nationals are eligible to apply for this graduate aptitude test. So candidates meeting the minimum eligibility criteria of participating institution or university so that appendix is given in the information bulletin which is linked in this page are eligible to apply for the GATB 2022 entrance examination. Okay. Now for the biotechnology eligibility test the academic qualification required is bachelors or masters in any discipline of biotechnology life sciences such as Biomedical, Bioinformatics, Biochemistry, Biophysics, Botany, Chemistry, Computational Biology, Genetics, Microbiology, Zoology or any other allied areas of Biology and Life Sciences are eligible to apply. Candidates admitted in any of the MSc MTech programs supported under the DBT Postgraduate Teaching Program shall be eligible to apply. Candidates who are yet to appear in the final semester of the examination or awaiting result of the final semester shall also be eligible to apply. So what is the marks? So minimum of 60% of marks for general EWS and OBC category and 55% marks for SCST differentially abled candidates. Now age limit is up to 28 years as of the last date of application and age relaxation is also given. Nationality, like I said, you should be a bona fide citizen and resident of India. Now, candidate who has either appeared or is due to appear in the final examination of their qualifying degree are also eligible to apply for BET 2022 under the result awaited category. Okay, so these examinations will be conducted in computer based test. Okay, so for more on the FAQ, for more on the information bulletin, or you even want to see the poster, the flyer. All of this is linked on this page and this page, like I said, is again linked in the description box. Do check out the description box because we have all of the important links such as this DBT GRF quick revisor course by Biotechnica which will help you ace these exams. You also have our app which is linked and the stores page in general so that you can check out various other entrance examination courses that we have. Okay, so the link to register is also given on this page. So do check it out. All the best. Follow us on all of our social media and also follow us on Telegram because all of these updates get posted there as well sooner. And make sure that you subscribe to this YouTube channel, turn on post notifications. We have interesting things coming up, especially soon on 15th of March. We have a raid webinar which you should not miss. So we'll see you there. Take care and have a nice day.